new this midday. A man in a clown mask robbed a convenience store, making it the third clown robbery in three weeks. Happened overnight on convoy near Othello. That's where 10 News reporter Hannah Mullins is right now. Hannah, do police think this is the same person or a copycat? Well, it's looking more and more like it's the same person. Now, I pulled a picture of a clown mask and showed it to an employee in last week's incident. She said it looks similar. Police today were much more tight-lipped, but they did tell me this was also a scary clown mask. San Diego police surrounded this 7-Eleven after yet another clerk faced a small armed man in a clown mask. Detectives with the robbery unit say the clown robber went in, flashed a large revolver, and demanded money. And he wasn't joking around. His mask was scary, and he kept saying to hurry up and was in and out with the cash in less than a minute. It was the same time last Wednesday morning another 7-Eleven was held up. The clerk did her best to keep calm as a man in a scary clown mask with a rainbow wig similar to this one walked up to the counter. I'm told he didn't aim the gun at her. He just put it on the counter to let her know he wasn't kidding. When he demanded cash, she cleaned out the register, but he only got between 50 and 75 bucks and some cigarettes. One week before, just a few miles away, a U.S. gas station was robbed in the middle of the night, and the guy was also wearing a creepy clown costume. After digging through the descriptions, it's not just the mask that could connect the robberies. The clown robber wears dark pants and a black hoodie, and he's always in a hurry. The clerk waited a couple hours to call 911, which delayed police. We do know there is video in this case. Police have been watching it over and over this morning to make sure they track this guy down. We're live in Kearney Mesa, Hannah Mullins, 10 News.